I got to tell you guys, I've been dropping the ball. I've been dropping the ball about delivering a message. A message to inspire you to consume the raw garlic. Honestly. Because it's something I stopped doing for a bit. I figured, well, you know, yeah, I feel pretty good. Like, maybe I just need more sleep. And I don't know. Like, no. Because I started getting sick again. I started feeling run down. All the screaming at work and in the gym. My voice just wasn't recovering. Just wasn't feeling good. And then it hit me. I got to get back on the raw garlic. And I got back on the raw garlic. And I'm telling you, like, that's why I'm making this video right now. If you're not eating raw garlic, specifically before you go to bed, because if you eat it at other points in the day, you're going to be stinky. You're going to smell. People aren't going to like you. Your breath's going to reek. Your BO is going to smell. Like I'm, I'm telling you, what I like to do is I like to suck down an entire bulb of raw garlic a couple hours before I go to bed. So let's say I go to bed at midnight. I start eating just little bits, you know, a clove here, clove there, clove here, clove there, clove here, clove there, until I suck down that entire bulb of raw garlic and I sleep better and I breathe better and I can feel, I can feel my heart health improving. My blood pressure, I can feel my blood pressure go down because sometimes I just feel like my eyeballs are going to burst and I can just, I just feel that my heart might be ticking a little too hard. But when I eat that garlic, I just feel the vessels release, the blood is pumping, the brain is getting better flow, no strokes, no heart attacks, no cardiac arrest. I feel like at peace. And that is the garlic. And I'm telling you guys, especially if heart disease runs in your family, heart disease runs rampant in my family. I'm talking, I've both my grandparents died of heart disease, uncles, heart attacks, high cholesterol, strokes in the family. Like heart disease is the wicked beast in my family lineage. And I eat that raw garlic and I tell you, those heart disease worries out the window, the vessels release, the capillaries are pumping. I feel good. And when I can, guys, when I can, because a lot of times I work out in the mornings or I work out before I go to work, when I can, I like to eat the raw garlic before I lift, if I have the opportunity. Like if I got a free day and I'm going to lift, I'm going to lift at home, I chomp down the raw garlic and I just feel like I can scream and I can be intense and I can consume more caffeine and my heart's not going to explode and I just feel better all around. Just the increased nitric oxide, just the, the capillaries and the vessels releasing and loosening the elasticity of the heart health. I'm telling you guys, I don't push many agendas, but I, I push this I push this agenda hard about garlic. I'm telling you, it's going to make you feel better. You're not going to be sick. You'll be able to run farther distances or push heavier weights or maintain the Valsalva maneuver harder and more intense without the worries of strokes and blood vessels exploding in your head. I've been doing you a disservice by not pushing the raw garlic and that's, that's a shame on me, tisk tisk. So I just figured I had to make this video. I had to remind you guys. And now there's even, uh, there's been some new studies out that it helps with dementia and preventing Alzheimer's and all that. And I think that's because, I mean, it just makes sense because you're getting more blood flow to your brain. Everything's just healthier, you guys. Everything feels better. <sighs> more blood, more gains, more blood, more life more blood, more nutrients, more oxygen. These are the things that we thrive on. You got to release the capillaries, release the vessels. I'm telling you, you're going to live a better life. Please consume the raw garlic.